There's no such thing as work-life balance. None! Just fucking do it! Subscribe now! Um, how does the government contract strategy fits into the plain vanilla QLA role? Oh no, I, I, to get started so you don't starve to death in the beginning. What? To get started and don't starve to death in the beginning. It gives you a means of cash flow. It has nothing to do with fucking kill. Well, I won't say that. I started this way and then I, I uh, pivoted, I guess. In the, in the QLA. But if you're not eating, and you, you can't pay your bills, and you're not uh, um, able to put food on the table, you don't have an opportunity to do QLA. So this is what, how I started, because I didn't have any money. Some of the kids have done this. Some of the kids have done this. But if you've got a job, keep it. You can keep, work a job and QLA at the same time. Marcus, Marcus well, not Marcus, but excuse me, Andrews Milner, did it for a year and a half. Uh, we had 60 hour week job, 60 hour week, um, QLA, Josh Kim, and a lot of the other guys have done it. If you're in the military, you can do QLA. Um, if you're a student, you can do QLA. But I tell more students, if you, if you're not in your last classes of, uh, being a student, get out and get out and, you know, do it. Of course, you gotta support yourself. Unfortunately, most students then wind up living at home, which can be very detrimental to your, your uh, QLA uh, march, because in general, parents are not going to be supportive. Um, in general, some are, but most aren't. Um, once in a while, parents will like it so much, they say, well, I'll, we'll support you in the next couple of years. That doesn't happen very often, but it, it has happened. And, you know, when it first happened, I mean... Uh, it's like, is this a trick fuck? I mean, why, you know. But some parents, you know, really do mean I support anything you want. They really do mean that. Most don't. That's just a fucking lie, you know. But, uh, 